The great Billy Graham once said these words, Troubles we bear trustfully can bring us a fresh vision of God and a new outlook on life, an outlook of peace and hope. I agree. Many people don't turn to God until they have great adversity in their lives. Uh, they wait until that moment of crisis, and then they turn to God, and they find in that turning a fresh vision, a new outlook, and peace and hope for the future. Proverbs 2, verse 2 says, Make your ear attentive to wisdom. Incline your heart to understanding. Wisdom and hope. They're traveling companions. Wise men and women learn to think optimistically about their lives, their futures, and their faith. But pessimists, they choose to focus their thoughts and their energies on negativity, the fault-finding, criticizing, complaining constantly. To be wise, we must choose hope and live accordingly to, to God's desire for us to live. To become wise, we must seek God's guidance. We must not only learn the lessons of life, we must live by them. Do you want the gifts of wisdom and hope? I pray that you do. I want that for you. Then I ask you to remember this. The ultimate source of wisdom is God. And when you take God at God's word and follow God's path, you will surely become a wise woman or a wise man. And you will never lose hope.